Good morning, friends. I'm Reverend Carla Leitner, the Associate Minister here at Unity San Diego. It's a beautiful day, June 21st, Monday, 2021. And it's beautiful, joy-filled day. In fact, our word for today in the Daily Word is joy. Now, for me, joy, I overflow with joy. That's the word I put on my white stone because I just love joy. It's not just, oh, I'm joyful. Oh, I'm happy. It's I am consumed and overflowing with this joy that just needs to express. It's this deep feeling of, whoa, wow. So I'm going to type in the comments the affirmation that I put. I am overflowing, overflowing with joy. To me, joy is this deep inner happiness, this deep inner sense of sense of fulfillment and sense of happiness. It's like you when you your child does a dance recital or a play or and you get this overwhelming happy tears of pride and joy. It's and to know that this is a natural state. A natural state for us to be in is just wonderful. I mean, it's really part of our divine essence. It's part of who we are, who I am, who you are. And it doesn't fluctuate. It doesn't fade. It's really not dependent on outside things because that joy is within each and every one of us. But it can help us to express our joy when touched by outside things. So. You know that song, I got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart, down in my heart. Could be down in your soul because I've been saying it for a long time, but it's down in your soul, in your heart, within us, that deep, deep joy. Knowing that really, when we look for the blessing in each and every situation, we find things to be joyful about, don't we? We think, find things to uplift us as we look at that which we choose to see, when we look at that which we choose to be. We can always find something wrong. We can always look on Facebook, we can look on Instagram, we can go online, we can watch the news, and we'll be inundated with everything that's wrong. <sighs> Eeyore, right? So, or we can look at the joy in each and everything. We can look for the happy things. We can look for the happy news, the great news. Things are opening up. I found this really cool thing to hold my mask on now that masks are an option. I mean, we, I found this really cool thing. It's like the glasses that you can wear. This just brought me joy because it's cool. It's nice. Your mask can be hanging here. You don't have to look for it. Just the little things. That, that bring us joy. When we have that spirit of the Christ presence of God within us, the God of our understanding, we are actually living from that. We feel the strength, this positivity in this joy. And even when times when outward appearances bother us, because we are spiritual beings having this human experience, but we are having a human experience and there are times when regular life just kind of bogs us down. But we can always go within. We can always go within to find this joy. And for me, joy is linked to gratitude. So when I'm grateful for something, when I say, wow, I may have short legs, but they work. Wow, I'm joyful that they work. I'm joyful that I have this blessing. I'm joyful for my family, for my friends, for knowing that I am divine, for knowing that joy is a natural state, for knowing that if I look, I will find positivity. I'm uplifted, not only in just the way I think or feel, but in the way I carry myself. I stand a little taller. I feel a little brighter. I get that twinkle in my eye because I'm knowing, I'm knowing that even in the midst of undesirable situations, I can open myself up to joy. 
There are many, many, many things to be grateful for, friends. And gratitude brings that joy. It brings that rush. We can feel that inner joy when we find things to be grateful for. Isaiah 55, 12 is the scripture for today with the daily word. It says, for you shall go out in joy and be led back in peace. The mountains and the hills before you shall burst into song and all the trees of the field shall clap their hands. Because we did something spectacular, maybe. Because something great happened, maybe. But really, because I am, you are, we are because I'm here, because I'm me, because you're you. That's enough for us to be joyful because we are expressions of the Christ presence. We are expressions of the God of our understanding. We are one. And what a joyful thing that is. It's a wonderful thing to feel joy about. Let's take a moment to just feel some gratitude, to listen, Go into the silence for a moment. We don't have to always be somber and still. We can be happy. We can smile. So let's do a happy smiling meditation today where we smile, where we laugh, where we feel joy. Where we know that the joy of the Lord, God, our understanding uplifts and blesses us each and every day. And that I am overflowing with joy. But let's just settle for a moment, but not too much because we're going to be smiling. Let's settle. I'm going to wiggle out my shoulders a little bit. Just take a breath. You breathe in. Let's just smile. Just breathe out. And as we take this time, friends, to go into meditation, I invite you to think happy thoughts. To think of something that you're truly, truly grateful for. Something, someone that brings a smile to your face. Something that makes you happy. And then we're going to take that deep within. And we're going to take that within our souls and within our hearts. So that we feel this uplifting, this exuberance of joy. So set aside any worries, any things, any thoughts beyond what we are grateful for. What in this moment am I grateful for? What in this moment brings me joy? And if I can't focus on an inner thing, let's focus on a person or an incident. Whether it's right now, it happened in the past or something you're looking forward to. Let's find something that's bringing us joy. For me, I'm leaving Wednesday to go to Georgia to visit my sister at her new home. That brings me joy. Not only the joy of being able to go somewhere, but to be with my sister, to be able to spend time with family. And then I bring that deeper within and I find the love of family and the love in my heart that I have for my family, my friends, knowing that that deep joy is outwardly expressed in my trip I'll be taking, but it's deep within that love of family, that love of community, that feeling, that feeling of love. And whether I have that feeling of love and joy for my immediate family, or whether we have it from our friends or ourselves, that joy is a deep wellspring within us. It begins with gratitude and begins with love. So let's take a moment to think about what brings us joy. And we'll start this with gratitude. I am grateful for. And then just fill that in. Fill that in. I am grateful for. I am grateful for friends, for family, for my everlasting relationship with the God of my understanding that I can access like a best friend at any time. I am grateful. I am joyful. 
so much gratitude, so much joy to have this loving relationship with the God of my understanding. Let's just take a moment, friends, to just go into the sense of gratitude and joy as we each have our own experience right now in the silence. I am grateful. I am so full of joy. God is joy and therefore I am joyful. God is joy and therefore I am joyful. And as I find things to express my joy and ways to express my joy, I know that when I am in this deeper experience, the joy is within me. Just like that spark of divinity that grows bigger and bigger as I acknowledge it, joy within me grows deeper and deeper and expresses so that I am overflowing in joy as I smile and laugh and know, and know that happiness and joy, joy is my natural state. It's a happy place to be. It's a loving place to be. And it's part of our spiritual foundation, that joyfulness, that peace, that love, that exuberance for life, that inner knowing that I am joy. I am joyful. And we say, thank you, thank you, thank you, God, for peace, for happiness, for joy, and for an inner knowing that life is joyful. Life can be fun and for our, the ability in our inner knowing that we can come to the God of our understanding at any time with anything. And we have this foundation, this divinity that includes joy. We say, thank you, thank you, God. And so it is. Amen. Just open our eyes as we feel ready. I feel happy to be joyful. I feel exuberant, like I just want to just want to hug myself, you know? I just want to be joyful. There's so many things, friends, to be joyful for. So many things to be grateful for. So many things that we can look to with positivity, happiness, and joy. And as we focus on our blessings and that divine love that we have within us, we're lifted up. We lift it up with this exuberance of joy, with this overflowing of joy, as we trust in the God of our understanding. And we feel this joy deep in our hearts. So friends, I hope you have a wonderful time, wonderful day. I will be gone till, uh, till the 6th of July when I'll be back. So I will be watching the prayers in the morning. I'll be loving and sending peace, joy, love to all of you while I'm visiting my sister and taking a little time off. Have a wonderful, wonderful Monday. Namaste.